Zenkosh Turarov versus Tyrone McKenna. Who do y'all think is gonna win this fight? To those who doesn't know, this fight's taking place this weekend, this Saturday on the 3rd of April, April 3, 2021, in the undercard of Herring versus Frampton over in Dubai in the UAE. Uh, I believe ESPN Plus will be showing us this fight, so tune into ESPN Plus if you want to see it. And in the UK, it will be on Channel 5. So, to those who doesn't know who Zankov Turarov is, he is an undefeated fighter from Kazakhstan, the country where Triple G is from. 24 0, 17 wins coming by way of knockout or TKO. He's fought all over the place, fought in, the, in his home country of Kazakhstan, fought here in the States, fought in the Dominican Republic, fought in Colombia, and now fighting in the UAE. In his 25th pro fight, hasn't fought in almost two years possibly due to the coronavirus as we all know there's something called the coronavirus COVID-19 lurking around that has affected everybody's lives uh, it has also affected the sport of boxing uh, preventing fights from happening and now Torero Bob is back against McKenna a 31 year old fighter from Northern Ireland aka the mighty salt 21 and 2 1 draw 6 wins coming by way of Nakar TKO um, he's coming off a tough loss against O'Hara Davis back in September of last year. Close fight. He also had a close loss to Jack Catterall back in 2018. So his two losses came from two good boxers and two close fights. Now here he is in his 25th fight as well against an undefeated fighter in Tour of Um It's a good fight, man. It's a good fight. I think, um, you know... Uh, McKenna has experience fighting outside the UK or outside Northern Ireland. Uh, fought in Spain, fought here in the States. So he's no uh, stranger to fighting outside his comfort zone. And um, yeah, it should be a good fight, man. I think uh, it will be a good test for both guys, both McKenna and Turarov. Um, in the end, I, I've i seen footage of Turarov. I mean, I've seen McKenna fight before, but from what I've seen of Turarov, he seems like it's a pretty exciting fighter, man. He seems like he's a guy who's willing to put his hands down, lure you in to exchanging with him, and he catches you. And I feel like he has real power. I feel like his power is real. 17 out of his 24 wins are by way of knockout or TKO, currently in a two-fight winning streak by TKO or knockout. Um, four of his last five fights ended by TKO or knockout. So he has a pretty good chance of knocking out McKenna. But McKenna has a pretty good chin from what I remember. Uh, so it should be, a, should be a good fight. should be a good fight. Uh, I'm leaning towards uh, Tua Rob. I just feel like, um, you know, from what I've seen of him, he seems like he's, uh, he's, seems like he's the future, a future um, star. Eh. Is he a future star? But I would say he's a future um, champion or a top contender from Kazakhstan at 140. I could I could definitely see him competing for a world title in the near future. So I, I'd go for Tura Rob. I mean, don't get me wrong. I think Tyrone McKenna is a tough dude, tough fighter. But uh, I was impressed with what I've seen of Tura Rob. So... But we'll see. You know, I could be wrong. I've been wrong many times before. I'm looking forward to this fight. Looking forward to this event. Cannot wait. I'll be tuning in on ESPN Plus. Again, Channel 5 over in the UK. Um, Turarov by... I think he's going to drop McKenna at least once. So I I, I think it's going to win either Turarov TKO late rounds or Turarov decision. Um, close decision win. So let me know what you guys think. Let me know your thoughts. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. And like always, have a great day. Alright, thanks.